Okay, so uh, let us start with problems uh, 3 and 4. Okay. A total of uh, 1,200 is invested at a simple interest. Hindi sinabi kong ordinary. 6% for 4 months. How much interest is earned on this investment? So, ang tinatanong niya is the I. Okay. I na naman ang term. Okay. So, total of uh, 1,200. So, I, I, uh, ano, I think that is the principal. Tapos sa uh, interest rate natin is 6%. Ang number of terms natin is in 4 months. Ayan, simple interest. Ibig sabihin, wala siyang binigay na exact date. We can say that this is an ordinary uh, interest rate lamang. Okay? So, I will be equal to P, I, and P. The principal is 1,200. Okay? Multiplied to I, which is 6%. 0.6 multiplied to 4 months in ordinary uh, ordinary year ordinary simple interest 4 months okay 4 months divide ko na lang na 12 months kasi ang bankers year is 12 months so we will calculate na year So that is 24 pesos ang tinubo. 24 pesos. Ipapautang ka ba ng ganito? In 4 months, 24 pesos lang. Okay. So 1,224 lang ang kitay. Yung ano, total future work. And for number, yan, so dalawa. Number four, Aircon Network Company borrowed, ayan, 5, 000, uh, 523,000. So, meron tayong principal na. On May 13, ayan, no? May 13. Take note na, on May 13. Okay. With interest due, ano yung due date? September. On the year 1999. Okay. 1999. Parang natin alam. Kung ano yan. Leap year ba yan? So, 1999. Divided by 4. Ano natin yung leap year? So, 1999. Divided by 4. Divided by 4. So, dapat whole number. So, this is not due date yet. Not due date. Hindi siya leap year. Pero, bibilangin natin yung days. Okay. Yan na naman tayo sa bilangan. Okay. Kung hindi leap year, therefore, yung February niya contain 28 days. February contain 28 days. Oh, yung first technique natin, yung bibilangin mo lahat ng araw. So, uh, January, that is 31. February, that is 28. January, February, March, that is 31 again. April, that is uh, 30. May, that is 31 again. Apo sa uh, June. That is January, February, March, April, May, June. That is 30. July. 
31, August, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, 31 ulit. September, August, September, 30. Tapos, uh, October, 31. November, 30. Tapos, December, 31. Ngayon, tignan mo yung dates niya. May 13. So, ito, hindi na kaya to. January, February, March, April. May 13. So, uh, from May 13. 31 minus 13. Tapos kasama yung June, that's 30. July, 31. August, 31. Tapos September, huwag mo nang bilangin yung 30. Cross out mo na to. Cross out mo na to. Cross out mo na to. September, ano? September 27. So, add mo na lang lahat. 30 minus 31. 30 minus 31. Hindi, 13 pala. Ayan. 31 pala ito. 31 minus 13. That is 18. Plus 30. Plus 31 plus 31 plus 27. That is 131. This is exact muna. Exact, eh ano, exact muna daw ang pinagkotol. Interest rate. Exact muna siya. Sa letter A. 137 days. So, ito yung first form. Ngayon, kung gusto mong mahirapan, mas, ano, pipiliin mo siyempre yung mas maikli. Ito, mas maikli ito. Mas ilang ano lang, buwan, ilang buwan lang yan. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5. Unlike ito, kung pipiliin mo yung kabila, yung ginawa ko kanina, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, mas mahaba pa yung calculation. Dito na ako, mag-stick na ako dito. So, uh, for exact simple interest, okay, exact, So, you have, interest lang naman yung nagpa, di ba? Interest rate. Find the interest. Yan. So, P. 523,500. Ang interest rate natin is 0.1%. Exact to, 137 divided by, ilang days yan, hindi naman leap year. So that is 365. Okay, calculate. So that is uh, 523, 500 times 0.1 times 137. The answer will be 19,648.138 pesos. Back your final answer. Okay. So for letter B, ordinary. Madali na pag ordinary. So, papalitan lang yun. Lahat ng days mo, uh, one month is equal to 30 days. So, yung Mayo mo is 30. Or 30. So, May. Yan. 30 minus 30. Ako siya susunod na buwan, June. June, tapos uh, that is 30. July, that is 30. Oh, 
August, 30. September, ganun pa rin naman. 20. 7. Ah. Ito So, uh, 30 minus 30. Plus. 30 plus 30 plus 30 plus 27. That is 130. So the interest is 523500 times uh, 0.1. Three seven divide by three sixty. Three hundred sixty. Kasi ano to ordinary lang. Ha? So five two three. Five two three. Five hundred times point one times one three seven. Ay, hindi pala one three four pala yan. One three four divide by three sixty. Pagbuhin ko na lang ha. One, three, four. The answer will be nineteen thousand four hundred eighty-five point eighty-two. That is for ordinary. Okay? So, uh, mas malaki pa rin yung tinubo. Kasi mas mahaba yung days na ano siya, tumubo. Okay? That is for problem number 4.